but I don't see anything sophisticated about his director's cut finisher. That thing is plain boorish. Inside the ring now. Finally, let's get this done inside the ring. Hey, the shoulders are down. And into the cover. a move like that, he's going to need a chiropractor in his near future. Of course, the director's cut, which we've seen Aiden English put so many people away with, drives the opponent's back, shoulders and head into the mat from a half Nelson position. Yeah, and if Aiden English can hit that director's cut here, there's a good chance this one will be over in a heartbeat. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out looking for the quick pin. I don't think even the referee was ready for that. Simon got in a relatively brief period of time. Is that he got it? And there's the bell. I think what we could see here is a classic chess match between these guys. I mean, one that's going to take power, speed, and aggression to win. And the turnbuckle does the damage. We're in the feeling out process. Who's going to get the advantage and maintain control? Your guess is as good as mine, Cole. Aiden English gets nailed. King, if you had to use one word to sum up John Cena as a superstar, maybe it would be power. He is possibly the most powerful, forceful performer we've got in WWE. Well, oh, you can say that again, Cole. Who needs finesse when you pack the kind of wallop that John Cena does? I mean, he is all about strength, muscle, and inflicting maximum damage. And uh, looking at Aiden English, what's the story for him right now? What hasn't been said already? Everybody's talking the unbelievable potential we're witnessing here. Let's just sit back and enjoy. This kind of offense he's known for. Yeah, you're right about that. He's made a name for himself with this. been talking about John Cena's power, but we can't forget about his technique either. He is definitely... He is a savvy performer, but I think it's the all-around power John has, power in his upper body, power in his legs, that truly puts him on a different level. Two. Back between the ropes. Oh, wow. <laughs> this. Look at this. Incredible. Cena's going to take a chance. Oh. And there's the count. He's doing everything he can to get his bearings back here. Otherwise, this match could be over. From the top. Nicely executed. Well, we're talking about John Cena's power and technique. You know, they both go so well together. It's exactly that type of complete package that makes him the superstar he is today. Truly awe-inspiring. That 
That's a classic textbook maneuver. Exactly the way it should be done. The tag team scene here in WWE is undergoing a bit of a renaissance, and it's because of action like this. And the ref starts to count. Aiden English hits the mat hard. Well, welcome to the big leagues, kid. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. Aiden English has a certain grace inside the ring, unlike anybody else I've seen in a long time. Where's Carroll? Yeah, I guess you have to attribute that to him being a classically trained actor and artist. Aiden English gets nailed. Look how slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. Seen here from Aiden English. I've heard it from countless superstars over the years, including Stone Cold Steve Austin, that this arena in Rosemont is their favorite arena to compete in. Aiden English certainly is a graceful competitor, King. I mean, we've seen leg drops before, and most of them are thunderous, but English's leg drop seems to accomplish the same result, but is a certain grace and dignity to it. Yeah, the same with his Centon Banco. The way English just glides through the air, there's a certain grandeur to it, that's for sure. A lot of pride on the line here in this tag team encounter, but only two of these competitors will end up getting what they came for, the win. Boy, there's no oh man from the high rent district. I wouldn't know what that's like. Wow, he's still down after that. Uh-oh, to take a chance like that. Do you know how badly he must want to win this? Uh-oh, here it comes. Daniel Bryan's really getting going in there, and we know what that could mean. Watch out for the flying goat. It looks like Daniel could tear through the entire WWE locker room once he gets going. Daniel's one of the toughest superstars to stop. Well, Daniel Bryan certainly has had memorable pay-per-view moments. Daniel Bryan versus Dolph Ziggler from 2010's Bragging Rights. Bryan, the United States champion. Ziggler, the Intercontinental champion. Both men going a mile a minute. Oh, man, that was an awesome match. Oh, my gosh! Folks, we're in Rosemont tonight, a city that has hosted several WrestleManias, including the second leg of WrestleMania II. This might be it. And Aiden English makes him pay in the worst way on that exchange. He's got to be history. Makes the plenty of fight left. You're right. This guy's still near 100%. I don't want to second guess Daniel Bryan, but he may be in deep trouble now. So far, he's been dominating this match, but you got to assume he'll need to tag in his partner sooner or later. Nobody home there. Nobody home? Cole, that looked like the house has been empty for months. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. These are great competitors, great, tremendous gladiators here in WWE. Some of the best superstars that WWE have to offer. Oh, that's it! That's gotta be it! Daniel Bryan! Now that's a finishing move right there, people. Not 
the first time we've seen this move tonight. Stay down! Stay down! There's the yes lock! He may have to tap out right here. Oh, man, look at his face. The pain has to be crippling. Aiden English certainly is a graceful competitor, King. I mean, we've seen leg drops before. They did it! They won the match! Oh, what a spectacular... Look at this! Let's see what happened during that... Oh, they mesmerized the W... Here are your winners, Daniel Bryan and John Cena. You want to talk about a tag team war? We most definitely witnessed just that. This was from bell to bell, a clinic in tag team wrestling. And there's the bell. And here we go. This is the type of battle that you can show someone who's new to our brand of entertainment and say, this is what WWE's all about. This battle just begun, and you can guarantee that these two are ready to go to war. The winner of this one will be making a statement that everyone will hear. Bree got hit so hard there, she might think she's Nikki. Oh, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a lack of trying, Michael. Nikki Bella lit up television screens in 2008 when she and her sister Brie debuted in WWE. The co-creator of Twin Magic has turned heads in WWE while being a former Divas champion, the 2013 Diva of the Year, and along with her sister Brie, a reality television star on the E! Network's Total Divas show. And so taking a look at Brie Bella, any thoughts come to mind? She's definitely among the most exciting divas on the roster right now, Michael. The sky is the limit. We're seeing two outstanding athletes looking to prove their dominance in there. But only one can walk out victorious. Who will it be? Makes the cover. You know, Colt, Nikki Bella, and she kicks out. Man, she's not just beautiful, she's tough, too. Wow! Hey, you have to remember, Nikki's not just a pretty face. She's a fighter in there. She's feisty. Oh, that's just how I like them. Who knows what's broken in there? No kidding. This could be really serious. And she's toast! to get on a roll. Oh, this could be exciting. I'm told her photo galleries are responsible for a good portion of WWE's.com's huge traffic numbers last month. this one. Yeah, this should be good. We've seen Nikki Bella polish off opponents in a number of ways over the years. 